Three dinos, take two, mark. Frame.io for Creative Cloud streamlines workflows. So all your collaborators can shoot, import, edit, export, comment, all in the same spot. The most exciting thing about this project for me was the idea of collaborating in this way, a real-time collaboration that took place in entirely different states and working to realize another filmmaker's vision of a project without the luxury of time. The concept for this trailer is Pandora's boxes have been dropped all over the world and whoever opens them, chaos erupts. We all tackled different aspects of this project. My responsibility was filming the gamer girl scene that opens up the trailer. And then I was also responsible for the VFX that you see throughout the entire trailer. The success of this trailer relies on the match shots. So I built a very specific shot list so everyone would know what the framing was, what the movement was, and how to match from one shot to the other. Valentina's actual production day was a part of our pre-pro since she shot the day before we did. So we were able to watch all those shots coming in real time. Then my DP and I could use those to make sure we were matching that visual language that they put into place. When Ryan was on set, I had him mark his favorite takes as approved within Frame.io. So when I was receiving them, I already knew, okay, this one is his favorite. Let me test this one out in the edit and see if it works. I just got a note back from Valentina. We got to run it back again. That last shot, we need the ball in frame for the match cut. So it matched perfectly, but we just need the ball in the frame. There's this sense that you're sketching ideas with the people that you're collaborating with. And this process feels like it moves fast and it feels like it's exciting. I was immediately starting to say, okay, well, I can pull out this little element here and this little element here and start transplanting some of that into the vibe of the title card that I'm creating. Camera to Cloud was so easy to use because the files they sent automatically. As soon as we stopped the recording, those files just whizzed on over to the cloud and onto everyone's iPads so that they had access and could see what the shots look like. I was also able to pull some frames of those shots so we could do that as an overlay on the monitor to get our shot as closely as possible before she ever even got it to test in the edit. With camera to cloud, it's essentially creating this think tank in your pocket where you can digitally bring all your closest collaborators together all at once to get feedback immediately and help you push that process and that iteration much faster. While they were still on set, I was already mocking up versions that I could show to them the same day. That way we could start building the VFX inside of After Effects immediately and it wasn't something that we did at the end of the project. I love being able to see comments from your team or clients right there in a little panel directly in Premiere or After Effects. You can you know, circle a thing and give a little note on a very specific part of the screen, which when you're creating things from scratch, like you often are with graphics, it's really nice being able to get specific instead of just talking about like, you know, that part with the thing. The filmmaking process is one that incorporates a lot of tools across a long process with a lot of different people. And it's one that it just takes time to get these elements in the different places. But Frame.io for Creative Cloud is really condensing that, making this digital space where you can bring everybody together more quickly to iterate along the process more easily. It's creating this atmosphere for filmmakers where you can collaborate in a way that you never really could before. And it's a process that I think is going to blow the doors off of filmmaking for specifically indie filmmakers.